25 laps is pretty demanding and it is a real test of the driver's ability to endure 25 laps, especially at the pace that they're driving at. And the green flag goes up, they go up for their warm up and then formation lap. Expect to see 1, 2, 3 and 4 all hotly contended. And by no means is the back of the field slow either. Drivers have finished their first warm-up lap as the lead cars will start to slow and they form up on the back straight. to start all important they'll want to try and get a nice lead but they don't want to jump the gun looking fairly good so far and aborted the start yellow flag up on the course they go for one more lap started not satisfied with the formation i think there was some debris kicked up on the track just some bits of rubber they go out for another formation lap For those who are wondering, some of the drivers have their hands on the carburetors sometimes just to try and adjust the fuel and air mixture while they're starting and the engines are just revving at a very low rate. The minute they get to the start though, they try to clean out the engine a bit, try and get a little bit of extra performance. As these engines warm up, it makes all the difference as you can see from Amin's drive earlier on. Engine temperature, carburetion, all important. And here we go for the start, green light. Lights go down and we are off and racing. And Eric makes an absolutely fantastic start, almost like it was clockwork this weekend. Raymond Low, 96, going tight on the inside of that corner, climbed the curve pretty high but got out and came out in second overall right now. He's followed behind by Peng Malakul, 2-1-2, currently in third. And Eric on a, off to a flying start. Absolutely fantastic driving from Eric all weekend in that Tony Kart. A testament to how strong this machinery is and how long it can last. As they cross the first lap in a 35.7 in second place, Raymond Lowe. In third place, Pang. Fourth place, Stephen Chen. And in fifth place, Kang Wang. Let's hope that Kang Wang has a better race here. So far, with one lap into the race, the people to watch, car number 68, car number 96, car 212, all chopping and changing the positions, moving up the order. Eric Ho pulling away down the back straight, though. Benjamin Go looks like he's getting the raw end of the deal here. A couple of spots from the bottom. Fairly slow start, I suspect the, the cars are carrying a little bit more fuel as well. You'll see the time start to drop as they get to the 10 lap mark. they still uh, got 23 laps to go. Yeah, absolutely mate. I just noticed that that, that warm up lap and that first fly lap was only a couple of tenths different. That's right, as the tires warm up and the engines warm up as well as the amount of fuel they're carrying, it, makes, it does make a bit of a difference to these vehicles. So it looks like there's a little bit of a race starting to be created behind Peng in third place. In fourth place we have Stephen Chen taking a look into turn one, not making the move just yet. In fifth, Kang Wang just behind and in sixth, 
Benjamin go on the back of that train. Ben is going to be looking to try and get around that lot in the next few laps. The increase in lap number does make some changes to the driver's strategies. They'll know whether they can last and how long they can last. Their times do drop off as we get closer to the finish of the race. So only drivers with good endurance will want to be trying to gamble to go hard at the end. 21 laps to go so far. Two second lead for the race leader on Raymond Lowe of Car 96. Peng is 0 0.6 seconds behind his teammate from Draka. Our uh, Peng doing extremely well to soak up the pressure there from Stephen and Benjamin Go up into fifth place. Good going, Ben. Oh. And Ben's managed to get past Stephen now. Steve Ben's moved up to fourth now on turn one. Uh, ben is definitely working his way up the order. We saw Stephen make a little bit of contact with Ben through there. And it looks like we have a driver out the, on the back straight there. I think it's part number 388, Peter Troyer. Oh, these new camera views are absolutely fantastic this year at the SKC as we see them coming out of that chicane. Absolutely breathtaking stuff. And you'll be wanting to watch Benjamin Go, car number 61, he's making his way through the order. He's closing down on Peng in car 212. 19 laps to go. And Peter Chua, car 388, has retired. He has retired on the back side of the circuit. All right, now Raymond Lowe is soaking up a lot of pressure on that train there with Peng and Benjamin Go behind him. Peng in a very, very difficult position, having to try and overtake second place while covering his line for four. And Benjamin Go is inching closer and closer, cart number 61. Waiting for his opportunity and opening to come. There's still 18 laps in this race. Uh, looks like Benjamin Goh's got a pretty stra smart strategy on him right now. He's definitely just trying to line him up. Not do anything too rash to cost him those points. I was just with uh, Ben in the office yesterday. He was trying to get a touch of the uh, SKC trophy, telling me how much he wants one. So uh, let's see right now how badly he wants it. I'm sure you'll be expecting to see his times drop as we go later on through the race. Currently on 17 laps to go, our race leader unchanged, he's got a 3.6 second lead, but it's second, third, fourth, fifth, and sixth all bunched up together. Yap King Rui goes on the inside, tries to go past, but unable to do so on Steven in uh, turn two. Our uh, Peng soaking up pressure again, I just noticed on the exit of turn one, Benjamin Go giving a little bit of a bump just to let him know that he's there. Uh, well, we got to say, uh, Pong Chai Peng has come a long way since the SKC in 2010. Ben tries to go on the inside. Peng manages to hold him off. Fantastic driving there from Peng. Oh, can and he get ben through? Gets past, oh. Coming down into the back straight on turn three, he gets past Peng. And it's Steven in. Yup, King Wing just hot on his heels right, right behind him on the back straight now. As we go into 15 laps to go, our race leader comes past. Fantastic driving there from Ben Go. Fantastic stuff. 10 laps in, 15 laps to go. And still the order changing constantly with Ben Go moving up to third overall currently, car number 61. Eric staying very consistent, 35s. Not trying to push it too hard, but maintaining a good pace. He knows he's got 15 laps to go. Yeah, we were just having a chat to Eric this morning and his only concern was his fitness. Uh, he hadn't, hadn't done any preparation for the 2011 season and came in just a few days before the entry forms with you. So uh, really good driving here from Eric. Let's hope that he can hold up his stamina. And Peng Wing gets passed on turn two, car number 68. He moves up again, one spot. He gets passed on turn two as he exits the corner. 
14 laps to go for these drivers. Here comes Bengo, he's right on Raymond's tail now. He's closed the gap. And Awi, as he's known, of Yap King Wing, part number